Hey guys, Popular Boat here, and today we're playing some more Hearts of Iron 4 as Netherlands in our Steel Wall campaign. Why are we so short on planes? I suppose two factories are not producing very many. Um, alright, so we've connected to Switzerland, we've kind of stolen from France, which I do not feel guilty about in the slightest. We're pushing around to Italy, which aren't actually at war with us yet. And that is a very long line. I think we're going to shorten that orange line to be that side of the river. Blue can be this side. Because I don't want them to start pushing and getting pushed right back here, because they don't have enough divisions. We need to make our way down to cut off this Maginot section, though. Where are you idiots going? Okay, let me just reassign these people. Okay. Um, orange group. You're kind of not defending where you're supposed to be. Can you stand in the right places? Okay, additional resources. Still only June. Uh, let's get next level fighters. hungry as a vessel or anything yet. Curious. You saved Varence, you deserve that land. Exactly what I'm thinking. <laughs> if they can't hold it themselves, they don't deserve to hold it at all. Germany keeps leaving bubbles as they rearrange all their, their troops. Alright. Let's shrink that line. Lots of free factories. Um, we need more guns. We're starting to run out of supplies on them. We're going to need more steel as well. Uh, probably more planes. United States, send us some steel. Okay. Germany dividing up Eastern Europe some more. Let's push on down. Push along, make our way towards Nuremberg. And these guys should be pushing harder than they are.
Oh, 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 pause. Japan's joined the Axis, Italy's joined the war against us. So that front is a lot more important now. Uh, let's get all those guys assigned onto there. Clear their instruction. Get those two to finish off that pocket. Give them a line that's quite short. One, two, three, four, five. Whew. All right, we need to get this Maginot line pocket closed soon. We can get those last four switched to steel wall, and any new divisions are going to be going into... That's not enough divisions to hold that front now. Let's get one more assigned. But really, they just need to be defensive. Okay, we're starting to see naval invasions down in Asia. It's time we switch them to be regular units. We'll just have to switch back to them every so often and make sure they're not fucked. Alright, close this. taking place. They don't actually have any naval um, landing set up yet. What we might do is add a line for destroyers that are going into Netherlands Indy. Give them like three factories I guess. So they're getting some sense of reinforcing. Help push into that. Tighten that noose. Getting a naval invasion into New Guinea. Let's offer Australia military access and they can help defend that shit. Those guys need a bunch of guns. Good thing we're producing a bunch of guns. Okay, sweet. We've made that pocket now to close it up. Yes, that's right, Germany. Walk walk out of Mel Mulhouse. Looks like they're walking out of the end too. Oh, why have you left a gap there, Mr. Battle Planner? Alright. Surprised Italy is not attacking us here. <laughs> French division still standing in the machinot. factory sabotaged. We were defeated and we lost a lot of important ships there. Those light cruisers would be very, very useful right about now. But that's alright. 
we will continue to manage. Okay, we're closing off them. Italy's got a lot of people there, but whatever. Germany's reshuffling its army again. <sighs> the AI for this leaves a lot to be desired. What we might do is free up those resources and then train new divisions. Can we actually deploy? No, we can't actually deploy in Indonesia. That's fine. <clears throat> oh, more factories being sabotaged. That's going to get annoying. We shouldn't be fixing those. We really don't need those forts now. Probably even push Italy back on their border without too much hassle. Let's extend orange down because blue doesn't really have the numbers to hold that at the moment. We've got free factories. Uh, guns. Guns, support equipment, maybe some planes. We really are not producing that many planes. Quite surprised for the number of factories we have working on it. Okay, Japan looks like they're actually doing naval invasions, which is a bit annoying. Would we, wouldn't we, when Germany's playing quite this badly. Fall of Rome. Woohoo. Good job, Britain. Uh, Alright, more of our doctrine. Um, yeah, we'll just continue with equipment effort. Until that's done. Let's move our planes to help the Maginot attack. Plans for Suriname into America or Congo to Africa? Um, 
plans at the moment are just to knock out the Axis and then see what the world looks like if the Soviets are doing dodgy things or if we can take on the Allies. Um, getting to Japan is going to be a bit tricky. I didn't think we'd be getting into Germany this easily, to be honest. But I should expect nothing less of the AI at this point, I think. Oh, don't go there. Yes, good job, Japan. You landed a naval invasion. And you have one there. Meh, Australia can deal with that. I don't think there's much in the way of resources there. No, there's not. Okay. I think we'll take our garrison off these islands that don't have resources. And keep them on the ones that do. Like, surely Germany could just click attack and we would get fucked. They've got so many divisions there. Oh, Alright, let's check out their losses now that we've closed off that pocket. Not the German-Polish war, German-Dutch war. We've lost 200,000, Germany has lost almost a million. Excellent. Did Japan just... Japan is in this war, why does it say allies not in this war? Hmm. Oh, Germany's still fighting Denmark. Options, options. Would be good if we can encircle some of the Italian troops. We also need our guys to get to useful positions. Because so we're so close to Berlin. Let's see if we can get this river. Let's grab those planes. Um, Probably just cover West Germany with them. It really isn't much, but Germany isn't throwing any planes back against us, so it is great. We can enjoy that modifier for having air superiority all we like. Don't really want to go fighting into the Alps, but I do want to encircle those few divisions there. Um, we could get guns ahead of time, which may actually be a good move. Thirty-four defense to twenty-eight. Soft attack of twelve over nine. Less reliability. I didn't know they dropped off to weapons three. That's interesting. So it has a lot, slightly larger production cost, but is also less reliable. That makes um, maintenance companies a bit more useful. And that makes that more tempting to get for just the flat bonuses to breakthrough and defense. Um, we could also upgrade guns, September. Hmm. 
maybe let's just bump up our encryption for now. Right, that's not going to be much of an encirclement. Oh, we did manage to overrun some though. That's always a nice thing to see. <clears throat> no, we're really not having much luck getting to the river. Until Germany just fucking abandons their lines. And then it is easy mode. I think half the reason we struggle a bit is because they just have so many troops moving through the area that we can't actually fight them once they all stack up, I mean. Germany's moving all these units to. Let's head to Salzburg. Uh, if we can get to those four um, ports, we can cut Italy off here. Shouldn't be too hard to do. Nope, still don't want to join the Allies. Go away. Okay, let's change Orange's plan and tell them to work towards Warsaw. Blue group, I want you to get to there. And failing that, get down to Palermo. line, go. Purple group, we lost a division. Probably in transit. Fleet down there is getting pretty hammered. Okay, we can cross here. At least Italy's trying to defend the Alps a little, unlike Germany. Nope. Want to kind of lock off Denmark? Be nice if these new units would train though. We're getting very close to Berlin though. Shouldn't be too long before we're there. Let's lock off a few more divisions. Why did you stop moving? Oh, because I reassigned. Of course. Okay, October 40. Let's grab Weapons 3 Research.
We can probably get closer to Salzburg now. <laughs> Italy has laid claims to Greece. Good luck with that. I don't know what the Allies are doing. France hasn't really done anything useful for a while. We could give them military access again and then they'll keep our borders populated. That could be worth doing actually. Since they're not really doing much else. take as long to get pushed back there. Excellent. Another little pocket. Who doesn't love a pocket full of Italians? Okay, we are pretty good on production of everything. Um, Starting to lose a lot of factories to uh, what's his names? Should probably do eh, more planes. We find for now. Where are our planes at the moment? How many has Germany got over East Germany? A lot. Alright, let's get ours covering northern Germany. And it's time for me to put a break in. Let them free their troops from the pocket. Why? Why would I let them get their troops out? <clears throat> Alright, time for me to put a break in. So, thank you. Look at that, that's crazy. Thank you guys for watching, I hope you're enjoying the series so far, like, subscribe, check out my other videos and the links below the video and I will see you in the next episode.